we're proof that black and white can work together. As long as we get paid. <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Yo, we're back again. Jesus Christ, four in a row. We did it. We made it to the finish line. Yo, another meaty set of Schmodown episodes here on the Schmodown Runback. My name is Sober Ryu. I'm with Shinjuku Station Podcasting and the YouTube, the YouTube, the YouTube channel of youtube.com slash shinjuku station but um if you guys uh if you guys have been kind enough to support us by subscribing to the channel make sure above all else to go to youtube.com slash collider videos and subscribe there there's a lot of great content on that channel they're pumping out content every fucking day bro don't ever sleep man don't sleep on youtube.com slash schmoes no either got a lot of great content there too but also what's important to me is that you guys support the original video that i'm doing commentary on you can find the link down below where it says watch this video first and uh, you can either watch the whole video or and, and, and play the game yourself or if you want to watch it at the same time you're watching this video you're more than welcome to simply just uh, play it start it um, at the same time I count down which we'll be doing in a few minutes but um, thank you for doing so and make sure to like and uh, comment on the original video as well it helps to bring in notoriety it helps to bring in views it helps to also um, help with the trends so um i don't it's a few minutes of your time i really hope you do that and uh, thank you for doing that if you did uh, in the meantime this episode i'm doing commentary on and reaction my reaction of course to uh matt atchity versus tim franco matt atchity is from rotten tomatoes but he's a reviewer in his own right um he's also on um uh what the flick i see him on there all the time doing movie reviews with the rest of the gang and tim franco is with late to the party yo another late to the party killer you know he's another person that people are gonna underestimate, but I'm in your book. I'm in your. I'm in your corner, Tim. I'm in your corner. I'm there, man. I'm ready. I'm ready to see you win. I'm ready to, to for you to avenge your teammates, man. After they were wronged, they were wronged in their match. You would not let this stand, bro. I'm ready to see you take it, bro. I'm ready. I'm excited, yo. I can't wait to see you win, Tim. And even if you don't, no hard feelings, man. You, the experience is what you what you really will get from this. And um, maybe, uh, maybe I, I don't know what the outcome is, thank goodness. So um, in just a moment, we're going to find out what that outcome is. And I really hope that Tim knocks uh, Matt out the park. But Matt is a as an excellent player of the game. So this is going to be super tough for uh, super tough for Tim, man. Uh, man, damn, damn, the stakes are high. It's not like team action. Those guys are just a bunch of jobbers. No, Matt is a uh, Matt is a toughie. It's an old toughie, and it's both their premier matches in the league. So um, you can say it's a five-five matchup. But uh, I, I've I've been watching Matt for years. He does know his shit. So, uh, but Tim, he's the wild card to me. Uh, I've seen him play the game on. Um, seen to play the game over on late to the party's youtube channel which is just search on youtube for late to the party you'll find them they got a lot of great reactions they were one of the uh, forerunners of doing reactions to the schmodown and then the rest of us got on board so <laughs> we're fucking posers all right we're fucking posers late to the party was one of the originators i see you <laughs> but i'm excited for this match man it's a singles match uh it aired originally on june 23rd uh, and um it props to the whole crew for late to the party for driving all the way from Arizona to uh, South, uh, South, sorry, South Calif Southern California. I want to say uh, it's like South, we say South Florida over here, but it's a SoCal or Southern California in California. So let me fix my face. Anyway, let's get to it, man. I blathered on enough. Uh, as always, uh, if you're gonna watch this video in step with the previous, uh, with the original video, you can just make sure to unpause when I say one. Here we go. Three, two, one. Woohoo! Let the planet explode! Alright, what we got here? Right now, round of applause for late to the party and one of the best showing. Yo, fuck these jackasses. God damn it, I'm you salty. What an impact you may be having on fans at home that are like, yeah, this could happen. Not late to the party, Watch but them. team action. React let me fix my them. face. Let let be out there. Let them know that you know movies and that you God damn team action. You made me mad. I get to go to bed angry tonight, man. Fuckers. Watch more movies. You beautiful Enjoy fucking heels. That being said, late to the party week isn't over. We have Tim Yo, Franco. God damn, yo, the whole gang. Woohoo! Tim the tank, Tim the tank. Look at his win. Look at his look at his answers. Yeah, Tim does look like fucking uh Andy Signor though. <laughs> there you go, man. Get those answers, bro. Let's do it! Yo, hopefully Andy Signore shows up this episode, man. His doppelganger. Alright. 
What pose you got for me, man? Tim, what you got for me? Yo, my man is sipping. Always sipping. Look at this guy. Yo, the vacationer. Oh, shit. Yo, he's wearing the shirt. Yo, yo is that the... Is that the fucking, uh, the Welcome Road Warrior? To the movie Lose his weight! Lose his weight! Yo, Napsock is back! You do, bro. But you're no longer wearing... You're no, you're no longer wearing Ellis' jacket, man. That brought you a good look, man. What happened? This past Tuesday, when Team Action played up against Late to the Party, two fans who came in here, and boy, did they impress. That yeah, they did make a great first impression, man. Good shit. Per, first round, including the bonus. There's a lot of fucking uh, uh, impressive match. A lot of uh, what's it? Uh, it out in the end because achievements they that that match. Stuff. They may they be fun to move, Bonus question. They do know their stuff. They did. Perfect round. Classic example of a team High score. winning even though they lost. A lot of gold letters. And that was late to the party. Fans who could have just buckled under the lights. I know, right? They, they became darlings. To you've seen the reaction so far from. They played from, the game from Twitter and everything else too. It ain't over. You talk about a bonus. We have a bonus. They have another guy in their stable, and his name is Tim Franco. All right. And you look at Tim Franco, and yeah, he might look like Andy. He's got to defend his house. Not Andy Signor. He may look like Andy Signor. The Tank Franco. <laughs> you watch, when I watched these guys when they were doing their reaction videos, I definitely noticed as a Robert and Vanessa, they were answering a lot of questions. Like, yeah, they're going to be good. And I reached out to them first, and then they brought this this other guy in. I said, who is this? Guy? He's getting everything right. Yeah. Everything. Every question. I was like, I don't know whether or not they're, 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 you know, he's who is this guy first, and right. then he's doing the reactions. But he, he wasn't. And he's no, he's, 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 he's a real deal, man. Questions. There's no point if I you watch him first. You think he has the good? I th that's not a genuine good. reaction. That's, hard, though. that's posing, hard, bro. Though, that's not real. It ain't easy today, and who's no. going up oh, against? Oh, no. This is almost like St uh, Stallone, Rocky going up against Creed. This is that type of matchup. This is a once-in-life opportunity that Franco's got here. Matt Atchity. Rotten tomatoes. That's that's this a tough guy, match, he bro. And breeze this Matt actually. I'm going for Tim, but man, this is not going to be easy at all. Matt actually has also done. TV has become a force. Yeah, he really has. And you're about to find that out on July 7th when you and Rachel Cushing play him and his team Absolutely. partner. Absolutely. I, I brought. Oh, that's I, true. Rachel, I brought it up. Yeah, that's coming up. Oh, yo, therapy. Stronger competitor. Yeah, that's what's up. Pretty good in the free. Get the help you need, up Ken. Up until Team Action, Rotten Tomatoes were the all-time team points leader in that right. one, in a single in a team match right. um, and that's a largely because of how good Matt the healing begins is. with you Matt actually didn't want to play singles it's not that I never asked him he didn't want to do it after that match with IGN I got an email the next day I know right I'm ready he got hungry, bro. He got. Go. He's hungry Byron now. He's starving. To play Tim Franco. Right. He called him out. He couldn't do it during scheduling. Actually, he's in. Wow. That's, oh, that's word. Setting up quite an interesting match here. I just don't know which way this will go, Christian. Well, let's get a little bit more from both competitors. Here we go. Uh, give it to me. I'm ready. You know, a lot of people have been asking me to do singles matches for a long time. Been a little hesitant. You know, Grace. Grace, a good partner, and we kind of cover each other's blind spots. But that's all right. That last team match that we did, uh, I ran the table, and I thought, you know, might be time. And I got a little competitive with Jim. Uh, Jim's Long time a coming, tough dude. Competitor. Both those guys in IG. Jim favored it, man. When's Jim going kind of solo? Me, so, uh, I, I thought Ashley you know, and Jim would be little, going uh, head to head. Hawaiian war dance. I guess they got to save that imagine, for, uh, this is for a little match. Surreal. We were sitting on Robert and Vanessa's couch, That's watching right. the We flipped the camera on, started reacting to these videos. And now we are here to compete in the show down and become a part of it. It's so surreal. Super excited. And I'm ready to. I'll be frothing at the mouth. I got to tell you, I'm, <laughs> I'm thinking about whether or not I'm testing the waters. I'm, I'm on the fence, right? I, I'm a little older than I think the average competitor. I may not as, be as fast as I once was. But you're a lot skinnier than but, you used to be, man. You know, I, I feel like I'm a You're actually slimmed like down. Maybe I got a shot. I might fuck. Maybe I got a shot. You know, tell me your secrets. A lot of people are thinking that uh, I'm going to have an easy time of it today. I don't know. I, I just watched the other That match. wheel could I fuck him. This is so crazy that I'm the first fan to compete in the Schmodown. The fact that I'm brought in here and I'm allowed to do this, I'm honored and I'm excited. At least in singles. And I'm ready to just rock and roll and I think I'm going to do well and I plan on doing well and representing the fans. So keep your, head, keep, you, keep your mind fan, right that's going in a winner. You leave a winner, right? I think a lot of people sitting on the other side realize, look, for what I do, I got to know a lot of movies. The other thing is, I gotta forget a lot of movies and clear out that cash in my head to, fun, to cover oh, the more cobwebs? movies that nobody's interested in. And the secret that a fan It's the bullshit movies that get you fucked in this man gives game. They really love, <laughs> and it cements that knowledge, and probably more in line with some of the questions that may come up in a schmodown. So, you know, I'm not trying to be overly humble here. I, I'm expecting a pretty good match. Uh, that being said, you know, I hope it's I close. Guess, uh, 
going to have some uh, some more Mai Tais just uh, to celebrate. Hey, Sip Matt up, Ashby, I know the fans out there are counting me out, but don't I'm not count counting you out, bro. I know my stuff. I'm with you, bro. Solidarity, I don't think I have man. Too many weaknesses. It's it's hard to find a weakness for me. All right. I have a lot of strengths, and I'm ready to show. Romantic you. comedies, you in there? I'm excited to uh, to to really beat you because it's a <laughs> vacation for me, kicking ass. <laughs> Actually, the master vacational. I mean, there's not much smack talk, and I didn't think that there no. would be. I mean, because Tim Franco thought he was going up against the that, that big old uh, rotten uh, Robert Meyer Burnett. Oh, talking some smack, but he's not getting that in actually. No, so that old switcheroo, man. It's, it's, it's Robert, why couldn't you about, be there, man? He's got respect, but he wants to prove himself. And actually, you Robert, see you need to make this up. The, sipping on the drink, and he just wants <laughs> got the Hawaiian shirt. He's just ready. He's just ready to play. Absolutely. I'm glad Atchity's getting his first match. I would love to hear that. Yeah, absolutely. Right. A little bit of a tale of the tape. Let's start with Matt, a Matt Atchity, like you said. Matchity is what I want to call Matt him. Matchity, yeah. Twitter that's, name. that's a Twitter yeah. handle, yeah. yeah. That's what I always think yeah, when I yeah, see it. Yeah. Uh, that's a good, that's a good Twitter handle, I gotta say. Some of them include classic the chasing dreams, bro. Fantasy and legacy, Sipping on my ties. And getting lost in the rain, Christian. Yeah, yeah. What's right. that Franco, word? He, uh, I, I did interview him before the show. He didn't, I'll say this, he didn't seem nervous. But definitely see. Yo, yo actually did the flitch. He says Oscars, <laughs> action, adventures, and of course. Why are you looking like Magnum, bro? Well, we're gonna find out. You need to get that mustache. Here, but before we do, we got more like Higgins from the five-time WCW oh, champion. I've been missing this man. T, who's got his pick? Your book? Can you dig it, dig it sucker? Dig it, sucker. Do do do. Scooby doo ba doo. Wee bop. Coming live from church. Let's go. Tim Franco takes on Matt from Rotten Tomatoes. Now, Tim has been doing an awesome job answering questions from his couch. How will he do under the bright lights? We're gonna. Who you going? Who you got? Who you got? I got Tim. I got Tim. Fuck. Fuck. The experience. He has the will. He does. To do it like it's supposed to be done. Now that's but Tim's been playing the game from home. All right, it's we the pressure that could get to him. Don't count Tim out. Some, some. It's like that. Hey, Tim ain't no, no ain't no geek on the street, bro. He's a geek on the well, couch. Knows his shit. All right. Tim Franco some love, Fix your Facebook. He goes with Matt Atchie, and I think that that's <laughs> betting odds would say that uh, Matt Atchie is probably the pick here in Vegas odds, but we don't know. No one. No one thought Robert from Late to the Party was going to get all Tim is about to regulate, bro. And a bonus. And a bonus, and and a bonus, bonus bro. So let's see what Tim Franco is going to do. Ken, I'm ready. Are you ready? I am absolutely ready. I'm fucking then ready. Let's get ready to Schmodown. <laughs> Introducing first. Representing. Oh. Late to the Party. What's this music, though? What's this music? Making his Schmodown. Oh, shit. Debut. Yo, is this. The is it Commando? Franco. It was Commando? Oh, looks like a train. Yes. Yes, yeah, John Matrix. Oh, yeah. Yo, yeah, hell yes. I like that he comes out and understands what the league is. Yo, he knows what time it is. Yeah. I'm proud of you, bro. You know, That's a fucking great movie, dude. I love me some fucking Commando. Yeah, usually I'm there. That soundtrack's the shit, too. He's ready to go. He's ready to go. It's got that Jamaican and flavor, too. It's fucking. Opponent. It's a little roster. It's a little roster. Uh oh. Uh oh. Representing. This is Jimmy Tomatoes. fucking Buffett? What the fuck Making is this song? his singles debut. He is the Kahuna, Matt Yo, I like that bass, though. Look, hey, look at this Matt, guy. The, laid -back the, the Kahuna. The, oh, my God. Oh, yeah. look, look at these characters. The Kahuna versus he's the Commando. He just wants to do this. Yo, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give, I'm gonna give Tim a four, cause he picked a good, he, 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 he did cosplay, he came out to a great music. I see you. I, I'll give Matt three point five. He didn't change his outfit. He was still wearing the same outfit he was in his title card. All right, that's half a point. That's half a point right there. Three point five. All right. They are going to write down. He came up with spirit. When they reveal it, they will reveal it to the camera, and they will say it at the same time. Each one worth one right. point apiece. You have 15 seconds to answer. All right, Tim, I know it's hard to do. I know it's hard to get eight questions in a row. It's tough. I hope you know your animation. And there is a challenge rule. You can challenge. If it gets overturned, you keep your challenge. If not, you lose your challenge. Oh, fuck. Also, if you happen to get all eight questions right, then you also have a bonus question worth one point. A piece. Let's go. Right, Matt Atchity, Don't let Matt get that bonus question, uh, goddammit. Tim Franco, are you Whew. ready? I am ready. Then All right. let's get let's... ready to Schmodown! 
All right. I'm ready. All right, here we go. Round number one. Let me get that question. Of comedy. Oh. John Cho and Cal Penn play oh my God. characters who have stonerific adventures in a trilogy of films. Oh, God. It's uh, White I'm Castle. Good. It's a... Uh... Why? Oh, fuck me. Um... I never thought about that. Well, oh, no. Harold and Kumar. Right. Holy right. shit. Harold and Kumar go to White Castle, that, that one trilogy. One down, Matt Atchie. Uh, Harold and Kumar. Correct, Correct. Tim. Harold and Kumar. Correct. Yes. All right, there you go. Well, Fun stuff. Good one, stuff. Good one, stuff. Good stuff. stuff. Great start. Question number two. Question number two from, comes to the category action adventure. The Long Kiss Goodnight stars which oh, wow. Gina Davis as a school teacher who has a past as an assassin. That's a great movie, mm. man. Not a lot of people talk about that movie, but it's Goodnight? awesome. You ever see that one? Uh, Gina Davis no, but, uh, with I Samuel Jackson. Past as an assassin. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. Tim. Yo, Ken, please. That would be Gina Davis. Yes, cool. sir. Yes, that would be Gina Davis, who so far we should not do movies for her husband, Rennie Harlan, about pirates. Yeah, yeah no <laughs> doubt. No, that's her husband? Fair for real? Warning. Oh, right, shit. Cut through Island? Oh, Famous damn. Famous and actresses. What Oscar-winning actress oh, wow. Jinx opposite Pierce Brosnan in the Bond film, Die Another Day? That's Halle Berry. Hmm. Were you good at GoldenEye? I was decent. But decent? Oh, I would shit. Run just staring at the sky. Nintendo 64 turned 21 years old One this week. Uh, I'm mind fucked. Be Halle Berry. That is yes. Correct. Tim Franco. Yes, it would be Halle Berry. Halle Berry. Oh Look shit! Each other here. 21 years old. Next category is. I remember when it came out, man. Name fuck. The film that earned both stars Denzel Washington oh, wow. and Viola Davis Oscar nominations. We talking about fences, fellas? Fences. Come on. I got nothing. You wouldn't know this one. No, I would. Oh, four. Oh, that's what. That's okay. I would hope so. I didn't see it, but fences. Yes, right, I this with you fucking no trailers. I didn't see it, and it's still fences. It's All fences. Right, here we go. <laughs> the next category of drama. Ooh, it's a You'll series. You'll find a veteran groupie and a self-proclaimed band aid, band aid, Penny Lane, in which 2001 drama? Oh, that's almost famous. Famous. I've never seen it, but I I, I know a little bit about it. Right. Almost famous. Four, Cameron Crowe, motherfuckers. One Matt Atchity. I will neither confirm nor deny my wife calls me in this bed, but almost <laughs> famous. <laughs> <laughs> Tim Franco. Yes. Woo! Look at that. Right, My man is staying on the razor's edge. Let's go. Toe -to -toe. All God right. damn, Question it's a, it's a gunfight. It's a gunfight. Animated. Jim Deere gives his wife, Darling, a cocker spaniel puppy for Christmas in which Disney classic? Oh, shit. Um, cocker spaniel puppy. Jim Deere. I mean, it's not one to 120, 101 Dalmatians, is it? Yeah, it's 101 Dalmatians. Said Peter Pan. That's no. Correct. 101 Dalmatians. I believe it is the lady but in that, that tramp. Oh, yeah, fix my face. Fuck me. Because the Cocker Spaniel is not a fucking Dalmatian. I'm an idiot. Yo, I thought I knew animation, man. But you know what? All that matters is Tim got the goddamn answer. That's what's up. Oh, yeah. Motherfucking Richard Dreyfus, who Christian does a spot on impression of. And I want to know the story about Natasha and, and, uh, and Richard Dreyfus. I have to know it someday. I know they joke about it behind the scenes. I misspelled his last name, but Richard Dreyfus. Yes, bro. Uh, there's a, there's a story there. It the wrong way, so we'll call it a watch. Richard right, that's fine. That's All right, so here we go. Richard so Dreyfus and his creepy ass laugh. Mm. Once again. Fucking Christian if nails Jim that Franco shit. It's fucking great. One, have a perfect round, <laughs> and we'll get a bonus God damn question. it. Here we go, Ken. Final question in this uh, first round category horror thriller. All right, let's do it. Robert Eggers directed which 2016 horror film based on 1600s New England folklore? Oh, shit. That's The Witch. The Vitch, whatever you want to call it. It's The Witch. I get scared just reading these categories. Yo, is Tim about to get eight? Oh, my God. Please let him get the fucking bonus question. One pens down to Matt Atchity. The Witch? Yes. Correct, Tim. Black Phillip. Yo, wow. Black Phillip, baby. Yo, what? Yo, America's favorite goat. What? His friend. God damn it, killing it tonight. What? A perfect. Round so perfect. Question for one seven golden point. letters, man. Yo, what go. is this, Marvel? In the category of mixed bag. All right. In Raiders of the Lost Ark, Sala prevents Indy from eating some poisoned food. I don't remember. Which was the food that was poisoned? Oh fuck. Dates. It's the one. Part. Wow! Yeah. Just like his boy. He just fucking just. A singles match. For one. He just did what <laughs> Bibiani did. He's the God only damn! Only other People have been struggling to get eight in a row. So Both these cats did it. That's amazing. Hitting 
nine points here going into round number two, and here's how round number two works. These Let's get competitors it. will spin the wheel. If it lands on a category they don't like the first time, they can spin again and have to stay on their second spin. Of course, if they land on opponent's choice, then they have to stay and their opponent will choose their category. All right. Each one is worth two points apiece unless you opt for multiple choice, then it goes down to one point. You can steal in this round. This is right, what's going to make all the difference, man. Lead. Would you like to go first or second? Oh, Tim gets a really strong action. category. All right, oh, man, you always go, go first. Right, give it a big spin, please. Man, there ain't no time to be gentlemen in this shit. A good spin. All right, good you spin. always spin, spin first. Spin. You get frame spin advantage. The spin is in. It's gonna land oh, on the... oh, man. Ooh, almost. Comedy. What, do comedy, you want this? Are you gonna keep it, bro? That's a broad spin, comedy. That's a broad category. Spin. All right. Spin. Right back on comedy. Our opponent's choice. But if you pick opponent's choice, what's this bad category really? We're gonna land on, and it's gonna land on. Ooh! Oh, uh, he's probably gonna be good at it. I'm All right, Matt, I'll be reading you not these questions doubt in round this. two, round two. But it's off the board, thank God. Romantic comedies. Hopefully, if you miss this question, question in, Tim when knows the Harry answer. Harry met Sally while driving to New York. Harry and Sally debate the ending of what classic? Casablanca? Film? Casablanca? Casablanca. That is correct for two yeah. points. I'm amazed I knew that. Question two. All right. What comedy starring Channing Tatum and Amanda Bynes is an adaptation of Shakespeare's Twelfth Night? Oh, shit. Ten Things I Hate About You? No. No, it's uh... a... Multiple choice? You Fuck can. yeah, I need that. Yeah. A, she's the man. B, what yes, I she's like the about man. you. And she's the man. C, easy A. Yep. D, bend it like Beckham. She's the man. Uh, that would be she's the man. That's yep. right for one, one point. point Matt Ash, okay. Taking the lead, taking right. the lead. Question three. Come on. <laughs> Question three. In oh, for Bridesmaids, real? after the engagement party, Annie goes home and bakes what for herself? I don't know. Brownies? I've never seen Bridesmaids. Multiple choices. Yeah. A, a cookie. B, a donut. C, a cake. D, a cupcake. A okay. cake. That is correct for a one cupcake. point. Oh, oh, shit. All right. Just one? Final question. In Waste a lot of batter. In 500 Days of Summer, what uh -oh. is Tom's favorite place in all of Los Angeles? Oh, I should know this. Uh, multiple choice, please. Fuck. A, a record store. Yeah, B, it's a, a park bench. C, a movie theater. D, a it's coffee It's a park shop. bench. It's a park bench. Record store? No. Incorrect. B. For the steal? It's B. Can I hear the options one more time? A, a record store. B, a park bench. It's a park C, bench. C, a movie theater. Matter of fact, one of the, a the movie's shop. most pivotal scenes takes place there. A park bench? That's correct. That's yes, big steal. Tim Franco is in a position that he gets a strong round two here. He can be in a commanding lead going into round three. All yeah, right, Tim, very true. Give it a spin, please. Big spin. Damn, I didn't realize all four of his questions had been burned. Yo, there, what a spin. great spin. Look at the tag. Yeah, that's a big spin, bro. You, you're ready for Wheel of Fortune, bro. Ready for, uh... Oh, fuck that! Dude, you're a brave man. You take that. I'm gonna spin again. Thank you, bro. Holy shit. Please don't land on opponent's choice. If this shit lands on Sandra Bullock again, I'm gonna fucking lose it. Alright, alright, alright. Good shit! Woo! Well, what a beginner's luck! Where are we going? Where are we going? I recommend taking opponent's choice. All right, here we go, Tim. What, what, what do you got? A comic book? I am going to take crime movies. Oh, crime shit. Movie. Okay. 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 Wow. That's a fair right. fucking choice. All right, here we go. It's a fair choice. For Tim Franco. All right, Tim. Who played Terry Leather? In oh, that would be Jason Statham. It's Jason Statham. Oh no, please. I believe that was Jason Statham. Thank you. Correct for two points. Good shit. All right. In the movie The Untouchables, actor Sean Connery as Jim Malone tells Kevin Costner's Elliot Ness that if Al Capone sells one of yours to the hospital, send one of his to the to morgue. Where? To the morgue. I believe that is the morgue. And that would be correct for two yes, more sir. points. Yes, sir. Damn. Yeah. Tim! Perfect so far. He's taken. In a good way. Name the movie <laughs> from the quote. You try and get something to These eat quotes. around here, and some son of a bitch comes up to you with a meat, meat cleaver. Meat Oh, wow. I don't know. Can I get multiple choice? You Thank can. you. Is it A, Bonnie and Clyde? B, Goodfellas? C, Scarface? D, China? I think it's Goodfellas. Goodfellas? Incorrect. Oh, it's shit. For one point, Matt. Scarf. The choices? It's no. probably Chinatown. Bonnie and Clyde? 
B, Goodfellas. C, Scarface. D, Chinatown. It's probably Chinatown. Uh, I'm going to say A. And that would be correct, correct for one point. Oh, well, fix back, my face. Back, 12. Woo, all right. All right. So, I needed that. that was clutch. That was clutch. Four for all right, Tim. Tim Franco. Tim, you got this, bro. It's all right. Whose organization was finally able to take down Pacino in Scarface? Well, it's the FBI, isn't it? Oh no no sorry it was uh, uh Sosa. That's correct. Yeah oh shit let me fix my face I'm thinking of I'm thinking of uh I'm thinking of fucking the Untouchables. I told you not to fuck me. Who the fuck you think you're talking to? Who the fuck you think I'm talking to? You fucking bell boy? They are going. Had to recalibrate myself with my crime flicks. That was a good fucking answer. All right all right good shit. You are in the lead. Please choose three numbers from 1 to 20. 10. Mix it up. 20. Mix it up. And 17. Good shit. Good shit. You did it. Like you did it. That's what we're right, talking about. Uh, Mix that shit up. Matt uh, I'm going to pick uh, That's lucky right. 7, yo 11, <clears throat> and lucky 13. 7, 11, and 13. Is that correct? Yes, All right. Sir. Here we go. All right. So That's in order, man. You mixed 7, 11, 13. That's all so odd. You fucked up. Here. You fucked up, Matt. Category God damn. From Matt Atchity. You chose Disney films. Disney films. Matt, how many years does the genie tell Aladdin he's been trapped in the lamp? Oh, shit. I want to say it was a millennia. 3,000? 10,000. 10,000. 10,000 millennia. It's a tough one. He's going to have yeah, to it's both a tough of his two here. Category number 11. Matt's going to get one of these. In the category of sports. Oof. All right. Three point. You will find the gym Average Joe's and its owner Peter Lafleur. Oh, um, which film? Fucking dodgeball. Dodgeball. Yeah. True underdog story. That's, That's correct. <laughs> he remembered the old title. Not out of the water yeah, yet. Yeah, he needs one more. Still yet. down by one. <laughs> he ended up with a clean twenty though. Hit his five pointer in order to force it back to Tim Franco. Dude, I'll be shocked. KO. If Tim don't win this. Category thirteen, you chose. Man. Lucky thirteen. Woo! Thirteen. <laughs> Category of Pixar films. Oh fuck! Animation. Is this your what strength? What is the bro? name of the young dinosaur protagonist in the Good Dinosaur? Oh, it's uh. One Pixar movie I haven't seen. Oh fuck! It's um, Milo or, uh, uh, uh sorry, something simple. Otto, uh, Arlo. Arlo. It's Arlo. Five, four, three. Jimmy. Of knockout, technical knockout, baby. Yeah, that's what I'm talking. If I've ever been on this fucking show, I'm coming out to the prices right thing. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> what? What is up? Good shit, Tim. But Tim murdered it, bro. All the training paid off. God damn, he got revenge for his team. He showed him proof, boy. Yeah. Yeah. Know what he would have done in the third round, but I mean, actually, unfortunately, luck didn't go his way. Yeah. Shows the wrong. That's the that's part of it. Yeah, he had a rough first fight, man. But you know, he's been killing it in teams. So he can walk away knowing that. That was I, we're kind of speechless, but the fucking music though. That we're so hype already, son. Him. We're just this bing, is bing, a bing, big, bing, bing, bing. Yo, the steel drums. Oh my listen, god! When you, I was surprised by William Bibiani when he came in in his first match, and I know William Bibiani. God, this joint. When he came in on his first match, was just annihilated. Didn't miss a question. Came in and destroyed. And you don't expect performances like that. You expect fun fact. Yo, Jeff Lowe from Marvel like wrote Franco answering questions Commando. From if the I other recall, if I recall, you're going okay. Well, how's he going to do under the lights? Sure. He showed us how he's going to do. He came in here. Without sleeves on, and he knew he everything. Did. He took the gloves the fuck off. One question, Christian. All and right, slap so people with the gloves. That's what he did. Actually, I'm sorry. Holy showdown! Oh, oh yes. my God, Tim! God that damn, was you represented. Impressive debut here. That's what How I'm talking about, feeling? bro. I'm feeling euphoric, and I'm you flexed on it, bro. I see you. I'm not sure if this is real life. It's a very stoic euphoric, by the way. But it did happen, and you walked away with the W, man. That was tough. Any better? I don't think. I mean. Yo, actually, man, it wasn't his day, went, if we got there, but, but it's definitely yours. Absolutely, no. You know, you TK'd Hatchity. Like, that's not slouch. You know, he was making his singles debut, but how scared were you going in there today about going up against yeah, someone I'm sure he like had that. some of the jitters, I man. I was nervous at first. But then, but then he pulled out the Bowie knife, and he got to work. I put on my face, I put on my outfit, That's and right. I focused, and I zoned in on the match. 
and I didn't really let anything just kind of interfere with me, and I just zoned in. And you came in with combos. What are you you crossed them up. Over there in Arizona, there's got to be something in the water. You use so meter. I drink a lot of craft beer. Uh, you can ask Robert Meyer Burnett you go, man. about that. I think he knows a little bit about that. He builds so meter by drinking. Craft beer. <laughs> so, so what's next for you? Are you going to come back? You're going to keep continuing to compete? He he'd actually do with yeah, supers. Yeah, I, mean, I, I like to come Left back. and right. I think, I think, based off my performance, I've really. I think I'm gonna have to come back. That's so, a fine fucking showing, um, man. I don't know. You Please know, Robert come back. Burnett, you know, he threw out a challenge to me, and then he, you know, that's right. He could be he could be your second uh, fucking opponent. Some scheduling issues. So. Oh yeah, uh, scheduling, schedule, issues. scheduling issues. Maybe when he grows a pair. Yo, he, Robert, Robert, man, you're my boy, but, but what the fuck? I, come on. We'll see. It's up to him. Now the clause. You know where Cancel your fucking Twitter meetings. <laughs> get there. Do the work. Burnett, talk some crap in 140 characters or less, and get out. There you go. Talk that yang. Lots of Arnold impersonations. Good shit. Good shit. Don't mess with a man that's willing to cover his entire body in eye black. All right. <laughs> Check in with that you. Oh, Matt. Yo, is it my time empty, bro? Tough way to tough way to open up your first singles. Nuts and bolts, nuts and bolts. I got screwed. Uh, no, you know what? <laughs> did Tim you earn that? Tim, Tim's a strong. He did. He did fucking earn that for real. Like I said before the match, like these guys, they know what they're doing. Were right? you a little it's... surprised that you were going up against a fan? Yeah, man. Having this much competition? No, I actually. Uh, Let's see, take three on this shit, man. They play the game well, every fucking week. Be, look, like the fans fly, again, let them fly like out. The knowledge that a fan has is equal to any pro in a lot, in a lot. Of Get Dave players. in there. And one of the things those tell them to bring more from Classic Game Room. I've got to keep so much other stuff going on. That Team Classic really Game Room. Really hard for me sometimes to remember some of the stuff I want to remember. Right, so you know, like I got to. It's funny, my boy Neo lives out in uh, Los Angeles. I mean, come he's on. my um. So it's for those that don't know, he's my you know, co-host on Gundam at MHQ. I got some, you know, got some bad spins on there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have yeah, rough. Yeah, you got some rough Not, spins. You know, I should tell Neo to Pixar. fucking. Yeah, you know the one Pixar. Movie well, then again, the Collider Studios is not open to the public, uh, so it's not know, like you can go there and sit in the like, audience. You know, Pixar, good. And then, uh, good I mean, I the could name, one movie. I could name Littlefoot from the other dinosaur movie. I know, right? Oh, it took me a second to fuck. It took me a minute to get to fucking Arlo. Burnett. That's a tough one, man. Tim's a, Tim's a player. Yeah. So take me through that last round. I know things. Sorry, Matt. You can win your next match. For you there. What were you thinking? I was thinking, God, I just don't want to embarrass myself, and and I did. Well, you know, the shirt I, didn't. Uh, well, we no, call it an embarrassment. I don't know that I agree with that. Uh, what I will say is this. <laughs> Yo, the blowups. Singles. I want to come back. I need to redeem yes. myself. So. Anyway. All right. That's the answer we all wanted to yeah, hear. Were, you know, will you come? Singles back? is a no, horse no, mis mistress, man. You don't uh, got the safety blanket of uh, of teams, man. Uh, not that yeah. that's an excuse. No, it shouldn't be. Take away from Tim's victory at all. You did it to yourself. That guy knows what he's doing, but uh, I, you know, gotta hit the gym. Gotta, gotta, you know, read some uh, IMDb. Read Go. some crack open the books. Uh, you know, watch bring out the flashcards. Look, uh, Gray and I. Watch the TCM. Count us out. We're we're ready to play. We got some good costumes for our next match. AMC. Ooh. Now speaking of your next Netflix. match, you guys are going up <clears throat> at Collision. What are you thinking going in there? Who do you face? How have you guys been preparing? You know, none of these are easy, right? And, and a lot of it is you really Team trip? with any trivia, you're, you're somewhat dependent on the luck of the draw. And you know, I, I actually feel a little bit more confident with Gray because we have. You know, there's some places we overlap, but we have a lot of varied interest. And so, are you are you nervous at all going up against Nerdwatch? Oh, of course I am. Oh, okay, it's Nerdwatch. Yeah, okay. I couldn't, I, I couldn't not be. I mean, they know, they know their stuff. I yeah, mean, man, there's gonna be. People that I would call that's Fort Knox, bro. Like that's Fort fucking Knox. But uh, you know, <laughs> just saying. Call it Yo, the science is uh, tight, bro. Again, uh, you know, <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, it's gonna, gonna, match. gonna be a good match. It's gonna be a tough one, but I I, I think Gray and I. It this way. We may be on a mission from God. Oh, 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 is that a hit? Is that a hit on how y'all coming out dressed? Oh, is he? Oh, 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 yo, that run back on Bibiani? Oh, totally, totally. But, you know, if I if I, if I I rematch, I gotta get that crime movie thing taken off the wheel. Oh. Yeah, you have to talk to the commissioner about that. So, next Good luck with that, buddy. Thank you. At, uh, collisions. Thank you. Clearly, I'm going to need it. Keep drinking. Back to you guys. <laughs> well, how about that? Franco calling out Burnett like we thought that he would do it. Good He's shit. He's going to call out Burnett. And now He's going to keep calling him out until he faces you, bro. That challenge. I'll tell you what. No I more would. running, Robert. 
Yeah, hey, Tim Franco is on the map. Matt Atchity <laughs> is back to two, and you know he, he left the spot he, blown. He caught some bad things. It's not the end. They got to redraw the map. Redraw the map now. Towards his match right. with you and Rachel Cushing coming up to the collider collision. I feel bad for you now because he's going to be looking for some revenge. Oh going shit! Going back to therapy this week and we'll right. talk about his shirt and his potential victory. Let it all there out, you Ken. Go, guys, how about Matt Atchity and Tim Franco? Make sure you check out Tim Franco on late to the party. Go ahead and congratulate. Congratulate him for his win today. Go and check him out. Check Congratulations out to Tim. There as well. He put check the work in. Actually. And you guys keep commenting, liking. More things like this can keep on happening. More matches like this. More opportunities. There is so much to be had in the world. Who's next? That's all I want to know. It won't be me. July but who's next? 7th, I'm excited to find out. It all goes oh, it's the boys. It's the boys are throwing up signs. Mark Riley. John Roker, Another masterpiece by Brian Ward. Ball, and that is not it by a long shot. Oh Rotten shit, there's gonna be a whole lot more. Versus the nerds we we'll get the appetizer, which is uh, Snyder versus uh, I'm uh sorry, let me fix Jeff my face, Snyder. not Snyder at all. I am also going um, to be calling a match against oh. who else but Mr. Jeremy Johns going for oh, yeah. the Inner Geekdom Championship against the appetizer Hector on uh, the 4th Navarro. of July with uh, top 10 versus Pride Patriots. That's it. In the world Before we get to the collision, down, which is a few days later. Check it out on Reddit, on Facebook, and check out Josh McCuga and that little skunk, Cody Hall. Yo, skunks? Yo, what about the pit inside the pit boss, man? What's up, movie trivia Shmoda, man? Inside Josh the Shmoda with the pit boss. Here again, Sons Cody Hall. We are Sons. still confused as to where he is. Apparently, is he dead? He has solved the Da Vinci Code. Apparently, he is living with Tom Hanks, working on the Da Vinci Code uh -oh. with Audrey Tattoo. He grew. It's kind of he grew a mullet. I miss you terribly, Cody. We'll see you in the next fantasy update. Cody, I'm sad, man. He cried himself to death. Matt Atchity, Tim <laughs> Franco, it was something impressive. Both it was really good. Going toe to toe, it was a heavyweight battle. They Let's didn't go. score a ton of points, but in singles, it is hard to score a lot of points. It really is, yeah. Fighting that hard. Steel, lost, you have, boom, you have to get bang, perfect. Which he got that a perfect round, but it's that second round that will get you. Body weight, but he lost nothing in his movie trivia brain. That's Tim right. Franco comes well, actually, out of nowhere. He's a fan. That's, that's, that's He's just working on a loss, but that's a win. I'm pretty good at movie trivia. I might be a savant. And what is he? He is exactly that. He is the Russell Crowe from A Beautiful Mind of Movie Trivia because he pulled off. Actually, he did it. I can do it, too. Matt actually has carried Rotten Tomatoes. Gotta Ray Drake, have a I love rest. you, but Matt Atchity is your whole team. They are a high-scoring, dynamic duo that is all Matt Atchity. And Matt Atchity, he's incredible. Matt Atchity, was, he was thought to be the Hulk Hogan, the Incredible Hulk, and Hulkamania all in one. <laughs> the Wild there you go. But Matt Atchity lost to a fan. A fan that the Wild Maniacs. Trend, giving fans out there everywhere the thought that maybe... Just maybe I can compete in the Schmodown and beat a mega power. Let's Lord do it. Matt Atchity, it is possible. Be cool. Be normal. Put a video out there. Make yourself undeniable, and you will. I'm trying. Get your chance in the Schmodown. I'm trying, but Matt didn't Atchity. even use me in the fucking clip show. Fuck. Franco, he is your dark horse. <laughs> Pick him up. Pull him up. Slipped on Make again. Him the Fuck me. Your team. He'll be back. I feel you, Tim. I feel ya. Whoa. Chucking that fucking mic always. Uh oh, uh oh, we got Cody. Oh, oh, that's where Cody's been? Yo, he's about to get scooped, yo, Rick. Oh, shit. Uh oh, Cody. Cody's hey, scheming? You like this oh, video, no. Click the thumbs up button. Yo, what's he also, doing with Cody, man? Cody's been corrupted. No. What's going on? Going on here don't, don't, don't deal. Don't fuck with my, my dear Cody, man. Cody's the best. Oh, yo, that's a wrong panel. Here we go. Yes. All right, man. So thank you for watching this uh, reaction with me. Uh, of course, this is, of course, Tim versus Matt Atchity. Shout out to Tim Franco for scoping the win. That's what I'm talking about. Late to the party goes home with the W, at least in some way, shape, or form. But um, nothing, if anything, I've got nothing but love for Vanessa and Robert for fucking putting up as strong fight as they did against Team Action. Team Action, uh, they they got lucky and spun that category, man. But they, uh, they did, they, they, I, I give them credit, too. They, uh... They handle their business at the end of the day. Ah, there we go. And um, if anything, I've got to uh, give them props on their victory. But uh, I'm, I'm proud to see that late to the party did as well as they did, and they get to go home. Man, don't be, don't be mad, don't be ashamed. You guys did very well, and keep practicing as always, as we all do as we watch the Schmodown for the first time. Man, I hope uh, the crowd that you watched the. Uh, um, 
the group that you watched the reactions to for these episodes with. I hope the, the head kind of things to say too. I'm about to run those back now that I've watched these episodes myself. So I'm looking forward to it. Make sure to check out Late to the Party on YouTube at youtube.com slash um, I don't think it's late to the party. Is it late to the party? Um, if that doesn't work, just search late to the party on YouTube. I wish I grabbed the URL. I should have done that. I know I'm subscribed to them, so if anything, make sure to check them out. I just see them in my feed, so I can just click on them. So <laughs> I don't know the address off the top, but uh, make sure to check out their channel when you have the time. Go there, subscribe to them. Also, make sure to go to youtube.com slash collider video and youtube.com slash schmoes now. Uh, and I'm shaking the desk. Let me, let me stop doing that. Also, make sure to check out these other links. Reddit.com slash r slash Schmodown. Um, also, check out Inside Schmodown with the Pit, and with the pit Boss on Facebook. And that's on the Facebook chan uh, Facebook page of YouTube. Sorry. Wow, I'm getting my, my URLs all fucked up. It's so late. Um, <laughs> Facebook.com slash group slash uh, Schmodown. Don't sleep. Go there. Become a part of the group. Hit that uh, hit that join button. Um, search for your po search your podcast app for Schmoes No. And make sure to subscribe. There's a lot of great uh, podcasts on there, including the Schmozo uh, Show, and of course the uh, Schmodown Rundown, and Outlaw Nation, and of course the Wengers, the Wengers Show. Don't sleep on the Wengers. <laughs> the Wengers have their own podcast too. Don't be a beardo is awesome, also, and also the the Horloff Podcast. I'm enjoying the hell out of that, man. Uh, it was nice to get an episode. Uh, the episode he did with Grace recently was really good. And um, was it with Grace? No, was it? I can't, yeah, he did one with Grace. It was Grace. That was the last episode I heard. Um, but also, Outlaw Nation has become my fast favorite on that channel, man. Really good. And I hear that the uh, Top 10 show might be coming back, guys. Uh, and maybe real soon. They're working out the details, man. Stay tuned. But uh, you can also find those shows on YouTube.com slash Schmoes No Podcast. Um, also, follow them on Twitter at Collider Video. At Schmoes No. At Christian Harloff. At SD Rundown. At underscore Schmodown underscore. And also check out our website at shinstation.blogspot.com. I'll be updating it real soon, but you can guys check out uh, some of our uh, archived uh, commentaries on different movies and TV shows and whatnot. They're up there. Hope you guys dig those. And also uh, check me out over on riff.tv slash shinstation. Uh, I've been doing uh, commentaries on... Uh, on sorry, commentaries on... I want to say Facebook now that it's fresh in my mind. Commentaries on Netflix uh, shows and movies. So if you guys want to check out what I got going there, I'll probably be doing a movie or two real soon. So be on the lookout over there. Just got partnered over there and over on YouTube. Um, no, sorry, that's not it. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Fighters Ready and Twitch.tv slash Level uh, uh, underscore Nine. That's N I N E spelled out. Those are the two gaming channels I have on Twitch. We just became affiliates, so if you guys want to check those out, please, by all means, you've probably seen the bumps before and after the these videos, so you guys probably already know about those channels already. So check them out, man. We've been doing a lot of streams lately, and I uh, hope you guys come on out, especially if you enjoy playing video games or watching people play video games and act the fucking fool like I do. Anyway, I'm out of here, guys. Thanks again for watching the Schmodown Run Back with your boy Sober Ryu, and... Uh, Thanks again for uh, being a part of this madness. I'm looking forward to the next set of episodes. And in until then, man, keep it easy, man. Peace, fellas and ladies. I'll see you later. I'm right with you, Red 3. Not a problem here. Eject! I can hold it! Pull up! No, I'm alright!